Greetings once again, and welcome to the pastor's message. October is known as Domestic Violence Month. Uh, it began uh, somewhere around the year of 1981. Uh, the color for the month, uh, strangely enough, for uh, domestic violence is the color purple. And uh, uh, perhaps uh, those around the world will celebrate, or not celebrate, but actually initiate the wearing of purple in regards to Domestic Violence Month. Our next story begins from the scriptures uh, regarding Absalom. Uh, Absalom in 2 Samuel 13 was the son of David and so was Amnon the son of David and he had a daughter named Tamar. Well, as the story goes and it's interesting reading uh, about this case of domestic violence uh, Amnon was in love, just terribly in love with his sister and he couldn't get over the fact that he loved his sister. So much so that he wanted her for himself. He was sick to the point where his friend told him, look, pretend to be sick and then ask your father, the king, to send your sister to you to feed you uh, while you're in bed. And he did so. Tamar went over, baked a cake, did everything thinking that she was doing sisterly love for brotherly love only to find out that her brother had evil in his heart and he wanted her for himself in a sexual manner she came she cooked for him and then she took the food to his room but he had a strange request he asked that everyone would leave and leave the house as soon as she went into his bedside he overpowered her and said, I want to lie with you. She said, please don't, don't, don't do me and put me to shame like this. But he had his way with her nevertheless. After he had had his way with her, the Bible says he hated her as much as he loved her. Then she says, my, what am I to do? I'm no good for anyone now. I have to take off my virgin clothes and I have to take off my, my outfit so people know that I'm not a, a virgin anymore. You have ruined my life. She went back home, the father found out, the father was upset. Now this domestic violence has set off an array of evil within the family. Absalom now found out and he hated his brother Amnon and he was determined that he was gonna take care of the matter. It took two years of planning. Finally, he had the opportunity to put to death his brother Amnon. And so he did. When he finished and got back, his father found out what Absalom had done to his brother. Again, his father upset, not only with Amnon now, but with Absalom as well. Absalom had to go into hiding, in other words, breaking up the family unit. Domestic violence does break up the family unit. It causes others to have to deal with the evil that one has committed, and now it sets off a chain reaction throughout the family. Help us to pray and to ask God to give us the wisdom to stop domestic violence. This is the message from October. I'm Bishop Palmer. God bless you.